and with another topic regarding prepositions okay so yesterday we had completed the preposition of time in previous class we had finished the preposition of time today i will be dealing with the preposition of place it is why important you know because in at on it is repeated uh, in time also and it is mentioned here on place also so please listen carefully now if i talk about at it is used for uh, two places it is used in two places pehla at it is indicating small places small cities like uh, uh, small cities like town not cities town village uske liye hum at use karte hain second it is talking about the exact position of a noun or a pronoun so uh, for an example i am sta uh, standing at the reception at the gate that is the exact place of or uh, the position of the person or anything it could be a person or thing anything so two usage used to show exact point used to show small areas villages towns and used in speaking of something at rest if say suppose i'm say uh, talking about the uh, position of a child he is sitting at desk theek hai desk ke thick desk ke pass he is sitting and desk is at rest means no movement so these are the things which you have to keep in mind i am standing at the reception uh, the temple is at the village theek hai and the third example as i told you now next is in it is to indicate the inside interior of something that is area that is the area inside so see to use uh, to show when the reference is not in specific place theek hai us bade se jagah mein kahi bhi koi bhi cheez ho sakti hai ya person ho sakta hai second it is talking about the bigger areas cities uh, now countries likewise i i live in india theek hai i lived in mumbai i lived in mumbai for 10 years so if we are talking about the bigger cities or we are talking about the countries then we are using in next is talking about on इन हमेशा समझो इट इज टॉकिंग अबाउट द एरिया ठीक है ऑन यूज होता है टू इंडिकेट द सरफेस ऑफ समथिंग समथिंग और समवन ऑन द सरफेस ऑफ द थिंग लाइक फॉर एन एग्जांपल यूज टू इंडिकेट पर्टिकुलर एरिया ऑफ प्लेस वेयर समथिंग इज कहां रखा हुआ है दैट इज द सरफेस उसके ऊपर सो दैट इज व्हाई इट इज ऑन तो इन के लिए एरिया को ध्यान में रखो इनसाइड ठीक है और ऑन के लिए सरफेस ध्यान रखो नेक्स्ट एग्जांपल इफ यू कैन सी माय बुक्स आर ऑन द टेबल माय बुक्स आर ऑन द टेबल एंड ही स्पेंट अ फ्यू डेज ऑन द आइलैंड सो दिस आर द एग्जांपल्स नेक्स्ट वी आर कमिंग टू द प्रीपोजिशन ऑफ डायरेक्शन ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है बेटा When to use to towards ये सारी चीजें बहुत बहुत जरूरी होती है Like from, it is indicating the origin कहाँ से वो start होता है It is in your time also यहाँ पे place indicate करता है He is from Mumbai He is from Mumbai There is a word hails H A I L S uh, Write the word and go for dictionary work Then second is point of departure पॉइंट ऑफ डिपार्चर फ्रॉम द प्लेस कि वो कहां से डिपार्ट किया थर्ड इज पॉइंट ऑफ ओरिजिन दैट इज फ्रॉम वेयर द पर्सन और द थिंग बिलोंग्स टू फाइन सो हियर दे केम फ्रॉम ऑस्ट्रेलिया फ्रॉम व्हिच प्लेस ऑस्ट्रेलिया द ट्रेन फ्रॉम कोलकाता हैज रीच्ड इज दैट क्लियर सो दिस आर द एरियाज द इट इज इंडिकेटिंग फ्रॉम देन ऑफ if i talk about not to switch off the light or no not that i am talking about the preposition of place of kaha use karenge it is indicating means from the surface of and also down from surface se kisi cheez ko hatana that is off and down niche se you need to bring something that is off 
एक बार एग्जाम्पल देख लो ही टुक हिज हैट ऑफ द टेबल उसने टेबल से अपना हैट हटाया नेक्स्ट टेक द पैकेट ऑफ द द शेल्फ शेल्फ के से नीचे उतारना डाउन फ्रॉम डाउन फ्रॉम द शेल्फ ठीक है सो दैट इज टॉकिंग अबाउट ओ डबल एफ ऑफ नेक्स्ट इट इज आउट ऑफ मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम टीचर्स आर टेलिंग द स्टूडेंट्स गो आउट ऑफ द क्लासरूम सो समथिंग गोइंग आउट फ्रॉम द इंटीरियर ऑफ समथिंग कहीं अंदर से बाहर दैट इज आउट ऑफ बहुत इजी है ना ही वेंट आउट ऑफ द रूम ना अगेंस्ट कब यूज करते हैं आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द प्रीपोजिशन ऑफ द प्लेस प्लीज कंफ्यूज नहीं होना अगेंस्ट का दूसरा भी यूसेज है बट राइट नाउ आई एम डीलिंग विद अगेंस्ट दैट इज रिलेटिंग टू द डायरेक्शन प्रीपोजिशन ऑफ डायरेक्शन अगेंस्ट इट इज इंडिकेटिंग टू थिंग्स पहले तो एक कॉन्टैक्ट किसी चीज के कॉन्टैक्ट में आना एंड विद अ प्रेशर and with a pressure see suppose uh, example he threw ball against the wall to usne pressure lagaya to hit the ball again uh, ball against the wall so contact ball came into the contact with the wall now next it is talking about uh, against means to have contact or pressure example dekh lo raman stood with his back against the wall when you are standing uh, uh, taking the rest on the wall that is creating pressure and you are in the contact of the wall so he is standing against the wall fine next we are talking about two two and towards bahut zaruri hai two is indicating the destination fixed place destination that is it is come he is coming to me mujhe pata hai the person is coming to me to talk theek hai but towards it is showing the direction ho sakta hai the person is coming to me or maybe he is going to somewhere else so that is the thing say suppose uh, uh, he is coming to me means i know he is coming towards me but i don't know whether he will come to me or he will go to somewhere else she uh, walked towards the river ho sakta hai river ke paas gayi ho or somewhere else near the area so to indicate karta hai the destination fixed place or towards indicate karta hai direction we don't know whether it will come the ball rolled towards me ball idhar bhi aa sakte hai mere paas bhi or it can go to some other place so destination to and towards direction now if uh, the example is she walked towards the river he is coming towards me that is not showing any confirmation 